Welcome to the XQ demo video. XQ is an intuitive two-in-one toolset built for CAPPM. Featuring a new GUI for Zog that includes a dynamic NSQL builder as well as a data extractor. This video covers the core functionality of the toolset, so we will show you how you can execute Zog runs and how to perform data extractions in and out of CAPPM environment. So let's get started. If you do not have a login, um, Please register an account. Once you register, you'll be prompted to log into the application. Once logged in, you're, you're brought into the home page. The home page contains the URL manager, the tool section, and some usage statistic reporting, which contains reporting on historical Zog requests. Now let's talk about the URL manager. The URL manager is utilized to assist end users in connecting to their CAPPM environment. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to add a URL here. Once we've added the URL, we can now utilize this URL within our tool sets. So the tool sets that we have are the SQL tool. The SQL tool allows end users to query the CAPPM database directly through the API layer, meaning you don't have to log into the database, as well as we have the Zog tool and we have a desktop version. So if for clients that are on demand, you want to use the web-based version. Um, so I'm going to open up the SQL tool and I'm going to select the URL that I want to connect to. Once the credentials are valid, it prompts me with a text box to be able to insert the query that I want to use. So I'm going to enter a query in here that I want to execute against the database. And then I'm going to give this query a name so this is, the, this is the name that it's going to contain inside of the NSQL inside of Clarity. And I'm going to execute this query. Okay. So once you see, when we execute it, it provides us the results down below, as well as an Excel file here, so we can export the results to Excel. And if we come back into the CAPPM environment, and we refresh this page, we can see that that particular query has been created and the NSQL dynamically generates the NSQL in flight for us. Now we're going to talk about the Zog tool. When we open up the Zog tool, um, notice that it didn't prompt us for credentials, although if we hadn't already logged in, it would have prompted us for credentials. So here, we're already logged in to that previous environment. Now what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to copy an XML file, and I'm going to paste it in here, and I'm going to click run. So this works exactly the same as the old Zog client, except you can say attach the results in an email or send me a notification via email. And I'm going to discuss a little bit of the bulk request. Okay, The bulk request allows you to do multiple batches of XML files at the same time. So here I've selected a zip file and I'm going to say run the file. Okay, And I'm going to refresh the result. Okay, And here you can see that actually this particular zip file contains seven files and it's executed all seven files. So now I could download the results or had I checked this box, I would have received them via an email. Now let's talk about the clients that are on premise. So for clients that are on premise, you actually want to download the desktop the desktop version. version works exactly the same as the web version, except it contains everything locally inside of your desktop. We have the preferences. The preferences allows you to add your URLs. It has some connection information in case your clarity is outside of your firewall and you need to set up proxy settings. And it gives you some basic look and feel options. Okay, We can run the SQL. So here we can just copy. And this one, we're just going to change the name. And it gives you, like I said, the ability to either see the results on the screen or export the results to Excel, as well as gives you the ability to do the Zog run. So here in the Zog run, we can do a single request. So we can paste an XML file like the other one, or we can do a bulk request. So for bulk request, now in this case, you can actually come and instead of going directly into a zip file, you can go into a folder. So here I can say, well, I would like to get this file here and I can open okay and I just execute run files and here you can see the execution time of each particular file this concludes the XQ demo video I would also like to mention that this free to use product is fully supported by ITROI solutions so if you have any questions or simply need some help please contact our support team via email at customer-support at ITROI solutions.com thanks for watching and enjoy the day